there I trust your day is going great so I want to show you another um, hidden feature in pixel app you know pixel app has a lot of awesome features you just have to discover them and um, I'll be showing you some of these features that's why you have to subscribe um, so um, yeah so do that if you haven't and so let me let me show you what I have for you today so um, the you know um, there's um, a merge event a, a, a function a, a, a function in pixel lab or an option rather where you can um, merge um, photos merge um, your elements your elements for example now I'm, I'm merging this element now so um, I want to merge um, this masking and or just everything my skin image is like so what you do is um you know normal ways to click on these um place here this is the third one here and then so are you sure you want to measure selected object they're asking you because you can't undo this so um you press ok so they have become one layer you can see here they have become one layer here you can see so um the, the, the thing is that yes you can move it easily now you can move it easily you can increase it you know reduce it but the problem is that um you can't undo this you know, that means um the only way that means let's say you have merged them now and let's say the reason for measuring it maybe they you know towards the center before right towards the center here yeah. the reason now for me merging it now let me say i want to move it I don't want it to be at the same time. Let me say I want to put it somewhere here, and that is why I I I made and I want to tie with the you know instead of you can't be moving it one by one. It's going to waste time. So he said, oh, the best thing to do is to just group them. So you group them now. But now and yes, you have placed it here. It's there now. But you can't undo it. The only way to undo it is to, of course, you take take it here now you have to take press this with donkey but the problem now is that this is what you want right but let's say now um why you are working while you're designing or creating this designer you know this now hey i made a mistake in this um maybe in the letter maybe you don't write masking before you or you made a mistake in the spelling but now you can't change it you can't change it and if you say oh let me take it back because the only way is to take it back it means now you will now take it back to the center and you want it to be at that place so what do you do that you can be able to group your elements move move them and still be able to edit them that's what i want to show you so um without um further ado this is what you do you come to this place here this place here set up and then um okay let me first of all them. so um this is what you do you click this place here yes you click on it and then you select the element you want to move together and i'm going to select the same element which is uh these um masking images and this now what you do now instead of clicking merge which is the third one you click on the second one and then um you do this now you can see you have um different options the, the first one is to rotate it the second one is um um to reduce it or increase it as the size to um so i'm going to select it again because if you touch it like that you have to yeah you have to do this again so um the, the third one is um relative position the fourth one is move that's what i'm going to use now so um you now you see we can move all of them together we can move all of them together see we can move together we can move together and of course um they are still not there they are, they are still having their different layers so let's say you want to reduce it you use this one see but the thing is that this one the you just have to um um, how will I put it now? You have to arrange it again yourself if you are using most times. So, um, so, um, so, well, it, it, it will take your time definitely. That's why you have to do it. Right? Yeah. But stay cool. So, but, but then the benefit is that you can edit what you want to edit. It's not like you did not merge them. Hope you get. So, um, like I said, there are different features. You can use this relative position. You can see it. Nice. So, and yet you still have your elements not matched so you can work on them but this one here yeah, i measured that's why i can't touch i can't edit this it's one layer now you can see 
so that's it so um so but then i know when to merge and when to use that one like for this now i can't get it uh, I, I just have to i just have to merge it that's what i chose to do so um, but for others i know when to use because this one i just showed you so that's it um, can you subscribe if you haven't and uh, stay tuned for more videos